New hope if you suffer from headaches. Researchers at the University of Cincinnati found getting treatment for another common condition could help you feel better. Local 12's Liz Bonus joins us now with what could make a difference in finding relief. Liz. Hey guys, good evening. A father-son team at the Headache and Facial Pain Center at the UC College of Medicine just completed this new study. They found if you suffer from headaches, you may be at an increased risk for a thyroid condition, which can throw off the balance of hormones in the body. Just look straight ahead. Marcia Stebe managed her symptoms of severe headaches for years until just a little while ago. And then they got really, really bad. Dr. Vincent Martin, a headache specialist, eventually put her on a combination of medications to reduce at least the frequency of those symptoms. I have a, a chart that I keep so I can tell exactly. Recently, however, Dr. Martin and his son Andrew, who's a medical student and researcher, discovered that Marcia and others who experience not just headaches but also fatigue, constipation, hair loss, you can get depressed with it as well, should get a common blood test. It's the result of a study the father-son team conducted, which shows if you have existing headaches, that in the future you're more prone to develop thyroid disease. As part of the study, the team reviewed those with headaches who were followed for more than a decade. What we found was that if you had a headache disorder of any kind, there was about a 20% increased risk of developing hypothyroidism over the next uh, 12 years. If you had mi probable migraine, there was about a 40% increased risk. Migraine and headache disorders and also hypothyroidism, you don't think of those two things being in the same category. So the bottom line in all this is if you experience headaches, there's some other tests you may want to ask your doctor about. And more importantly, maybe you need to be treated for those problems. While the headaches might not go away, it still could make sure that your health is improved and overall you'll physically feel better. You see, low thyroid can be treated with medication, which can help you with everything from energy levels to weight loss. Sometimes headaches can kick up as a result of uh, low thyroid as well or hypothyroidism. The good news, all of this gives us new insight to treating and beating headaches. Oh yes, if I go one month, I consider it a blessing. I can live with that, but I can't live with them constantly. Oh boy, this information was available as a long-term follow-up from the Fernald study. You remember that was yes, the environmental health sure. study for people who lived outside Crosby Township in an uranium plant. So they had that those years of data, a dozen years, okay. they could look back. Now they weren't saying that the environmental causes were the problem with the headache, they just said people that get headaches have thyroid problems. Yeah. And maybe if we treat that overall, the body will feel better. Right. You never know if all the headaches will go away, but it certainly can't hurt. And it, everything's connected. You we know? are such delicate beings. For sure. Fearful and wonderfully made. Yes. Huh? Thanks, Kim. All right, thank you.